After months of waiting, we finally managed to get our hands on Mortal Kombat X's story mode. In essence, it plays like Mortal Kombat 9 and Injustices. While there's more information in our full preview over on IGN.com, what we're more interested in talking about right here is the huge number of characters that made an appearance, leading to rumours about who may be the next fighter to return for the brawler. Now, Johnny Cage and Sonya Blade are both now confirmed to return while we played against both Jax and Shinnok. While we don't know if they'll be playable, it'll be a bit odd for Netherrealm to bother giving them a full moveset if we aren't going to be able to control them. But the most exciting part was all the familiar faces we saw in cutscenes that have never appeared in connection with this title before. Smoke, Nightwolf, Kenshi, Fujin, Striker and Cabal all cropped up. Other than Kenshi, who was revealed as being playable in the mobile version of MKX a few days ago, none of these characters have been seen in any previous trailer. Now, are they playable or are they just chilling in the background? We've no idea yet, but there are a bunch more slots on the character select screen that need to be filled. So it's quite likely that some, if not all of these characters are indeed playable. Now, for more on Mortal Kombat X as we career towards its imminent release, stick with IGM.